peace and welcomings to your Gona Art family. Uh, today, we're going to do a little different video today. Um, I'm going to be critiquing my old artwork. So I'm going to be critiquing the introductions of my comic. You know, you, you'll be seeing the, the changes that I made. So if you follow the, the comic on the past, you'll see that I changed up a lot. I redid, I redid some pages and revised some pages, you know, etc. So... I'm going to be doing the uh, the introduction section for this video, and so if you enjoyed this video, you know, you know, thumbs up or so, you know, tell me what you think about it. So I'm going to be critiquing this. So the first the first panel, you're gonna sh you're gonna see some of the changes. So in the first panel, I uh, we'll just zoom in here. The first panel looks you know similar. You'll see like all this text here. So I have like welcome to an enormous planet called Asuka it supports intelligent life and other life forms existing into dimensionally invisible to the to the naked eye. So I I presented this. This is like a, a text, but however the interdimensional beings like you really don't see them much, you know. So that's why like in, in comics there's this thing called called show and tell. You know, so as as your your dialogue, your dialogue should uh, should match, you know, whatever you're presenting visually. Okay, so right here, I was doing that. I was doing that a little bit f for for uh, presenting this creature, for showing this creature. However, like I know that a lot of people would wouldn't really pay attention to something like this. You know. Cause it's like all the way in a, it, it it blends in with the background and with the world like you wouldn't really think to yourself that you know interdimensional creature invisible to the naked eye and you wouldn't connect it with this creature here and so that's that's one thing I changed up in the in the uh, the newer ones so right here I introduced the world okay so I showed the world outside and I automatically zoomed into like what was going on in a certain kingdom as opposed to, you know, showing what Asuka, the, the world looks like. So I just zoomed in into like a city where something major was going to happen. You know, what I thought I should have done was, you know, introduce the world, you know, go go to the world. You know, zoom in on like a, you know a forest area or something. Show so show the different creatures, uh, and show various other things about the world that I didn't in the other in the previous introduction. So in the in a newer one, in a newer one, you'll see a few changes here and there. You know, the the world introduction here is the same. Uh, you know changed up the trees a little bit and I I made this creature as you can see now it's like two different creatures as opposed to one because I uh, I have the, the story I, I thought about something regarding these two beings but anyway it now is like these two uh, different creatures now and so I just have a simple text welcome to Asuka you know and then I, I'm zooming into the to the forest. I'm showing like the, the forest land and whatnot. And this is where the show and tell comes in. You know, it gives like a massive focus on the the uh, the interdimensional creatures. I'm not just saying that this is the interdimensional creatures because people probably wouldn't really connect it, but they'd connect that they, these are the interdimensional beings that. I'm referring to because there's a panel separately for for them you know so yeah there's a panel separately for them and you have this big creature here not only that you have a, a human it may be subtle people may pick this up subconsciously I even have like a human like walking you know the, the, the human is not paying attention to these beings you know so people may get a subconscious approach as to Okay, these are the interdimensional beings, and people cannot see it because you have this this female here that is not able to see it. But you know, people people pick this people pick this stuff up subconsciously. They're not they're not aware of it.
but that's something to keep keep in keep keep in mind you know then right here i introduced that the the world has is a uh, as a you know crystal power technology that's something that's uh unique to you know oscar as a whole like every single kingdom the entire world has this crystal power technology which wasn't like uh fully introduced here because i immediately introduced introduced the world and it went straight into the civilization without introducing certain aspects of the world so right here you see this uh this uh this thing like you'll see this crystal here you know but you wouldn't really know that it's the it's uh you know crystal power technology you know this is like a crystal mutation going on on the cruise on the cruise ship but you wouldn't really know that okay it, and so that's why i felt that you know introducing what the crystals are are doing or is also best to you know get a full grasp of, of the world because now you'll see that you know oscar is like a much more wider thing you know so in the older the older pages i ha i only have like two two page it was a two page introduction when i redid this it became a three page introduction and since it's a three page introduction you know i managed to, to put space onto oscar and you know that's when i uh moved on so the second page is going to dive into stuff that are that's going on in the beastman kingdom and i can put a lot more focus onto the things that are being into the beastman kingdom because i'll have a lot more panels to you know play with so that's what i did here okay okay so this this is the uh the second page of the old introduction you know so it just went from here it went from the the one that the old one that you saw before to, to this so this is just two pages so this is like the the newer introduction remember the new new the new introduction is three pages okay so in the new introduction i introduced the uh, you know the, you you're you're diving into the to the to the city like now now that you've got a grasp of what the interdimensional creatures are and crystal power technology like that's what Oscar is. That's that's part of the world. Now we're diving into what the kingdom is like. Okay, that's where the main focus of the story is going to be at the moment. Okay, so I I explain, you know, this is the kingdom. Now I'm zooming in. You know, I'm like far out. You know, now I'm zooming into the city. This is the this is the uh, yeah the country here. Now I'm zooming into the country here, and then after that, I'm just explaining the entire lore about uh, you know the foreign nobles and whatnot. I'm just explaining what took place here, you know. And since this is a lot more pounds, I can do a lot more things. I could put a lot more lore into it, you know, as opposed to the this thing when I introduced the Beastman Kingdom, I. I didn't put a lot of lore into the Beastman Kingdom here because it was just a two-page introduction, you know. So it was really uh, scrunched up together, so to say. Okay. So that's so that's the that was the major change for for this page. So now you can see you can just see the entire lore, the the foreign the foreigners that conquered the Beastman and whatnot. The, the Beastman that conspired against their own nation. You get get a grasp of you know the the class hierarchy and whatnot what's going on in other sections what's going on in you know majesty and whatnot so that's what i put for the second page you know and so a lot can be done in like three pages you know and so for the the third page okay the third page so like i said before this you know this looks the same because this part looks the same because um this was the second page of the old introduction okay this is the second page of the new introduction so what i did with the second page of the old introduction i made it the third page of the new introduction okay so this is the third page of the new introduction this was the second page as you can see there are, there is a different uh, camera shifts here 
So I just changed the camera a bit. It's pretty much the same thing that's going on. I just changed the camera a bit because people can read it as like going, you know, right to left, even though it's read from left to right. So that's why I changed the camera angle a little bit because you can see it from here is going here and then it's doing this and you know it's doing that like it's the camera's going here even though it's red red from um even though it's red in in in, in, in an American format okay so this is and it, and you can you can you can you don't have to be strict with it there are certain times where you can like you know change up the camera and we'll do that but you know for in this case I wanted to have it like be fluid to the reader you know make it easier so that's what I did so the, this is the camera angle now as you can see it's going from this it's, introdu it's introducing this from this way it introduces the the grand head the king so to say and it and it shows you know all the other stuff that's going on you know the line work is a lot cleaner because I got a lot more experience because from this um, one thing I probably would change up a little bit is the 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 peacekeepers here you know they're like from from here from the old one there you can see a lot more a lot more peacekeepers in the background as opposed to this there's like four peacekeepers if I were to change this up I'd like take uh, take the take the the background peacekeepers at them in there individually you know and then there this there's this um you know this this is cool too this is a lot more refined and defined anatomy as opposed to this but you know i this is this is also cool and i i'd also you know prefer this the, i guess the only thing I'd, I'd like to keep from the old one was just adding like the tiny little peacekeepers in the background and so like the artwork is a lot more defined here okay yeah the arc is a lot more fine this is like really dark i made it i made it lighter so that people could see the line work and what the sharks look like you know so that's why that that's the change that you see here you know and uh because this is darker and this is lighter and you know this is pretty much the same thing and then after they fall and then after that you know the falling takes place and you you may not notice this but um previously you you wouldn't know how the how how in the world like they they fell in the first place there was like no sign of activation you know they just fell you know they were suddenly here no one like chopped the switch they no one pushed a button or anything like that you know so they just fell so what i did here was just add one of my uh one of the species one of the races what what they can do like they're like uh they're they're great jumpers and climbers and, and whatnot so i just added one of the species to activate the uh this thing here so that they can fall to their deaths and so yeah th these are pretty much the changes how long is this video going yeah these are pretty much the changes this is good so these are the changes and you know if you enjoyed the video you know leave a like etc tell me what you think you know and i'll do a lot more of these uh critiques so yeah Okay, peace out. And consider subscribing to the family. So you can hit that. And don't forget to uh, hit the, the red bell button for to get notified for when I upload every Saturday. So when you click that, you'll see this. You can click the chat box to send the notifications for you. And then just save it. I also provide you guys a Discord or a place to chat. My Discord will be available in a link down below i provide references you know for anyone that want to you know look into it you know so i have references for you know ears breasts you know front torso back torso etc and including hands as well and this is where you can you know just chat with a family and you can share your artwork here etc that's just the basis of the discord check it out whatnot and that'll be the video thank you guys for watching peace out